can't believe I missed the board meeting. Oh. Don't worry about it, Eve. Everyone knows how busy you are. Julian couldn't attend either. That's why I had to stand in for him. Well, I hope the board expressed its gratitude for your donation of the new pediatric wing. Absolutely, yes. Ah, here comes your charming husband. Hello, TC. Ivy. I was just telling your wife how I filled in for Julian tonight here at the board meeting. Actually, it's probably a good thing that Julian didn't attend. Eve here seems to be able to get more money out of my husband for charity than anyone I know. Well, my wife is a very persuasive woman. <laughs> well, I'm sure she is. But Julian is notoriously, shall we say, thrifty. <sighs> hmm, if I didn't know better, I'd swear you had some secret hold over my husband. Now, don't deny it, Eve. You have some special hold over Julian that TC and I don't know about. Oh, I don't think so, Ivy. I, I, I just told him how much we could use a new pediatric wing. Hmm. Still, I don't think anyone else would have gotten through to him to quite the same tune that you did. He must have something to do with your reputation. Oh, come on. They call you Saint Eve behind your back. And that's for a very good reason. My wife is taking care of an old gentleman tonight, and uh, this guy doesn't have any family, any friends. And she's been by his bedside ever since his accident. Oh, what happened? Hit and run. Oh, how awful. Will he pull through? Oh, we don't know yet. He's, he's uh, having a rough time. And even before that, he had problems. Didn't make much sense half the time. And can hardly remember anything now. Oh, poor man. I had a relative who went through that with Alzheimer's. Let me know if there's anything I can do. If the insurance doesn't cover his treatment, then just send the bills to us. Ivy, that's very generous of you. I guess my wife has a way with you the same way she has with your husband. <laughs> yes, it seems so. Well, if you'll excuse me, I need to get home. Check on my son, Ethan. It was nice to see both of you again. You too. <laughs> I sent you upstairs so you and Ethan could work this out and make up. Look, I know you meant well, but he wasn't by himself. What do you mean? Teresa! I found him with Teresa. We're together. Teresa, what were they Look, doing? Ivy, I don't want to talk about it. I, I can't stop crying. Okay. What on earth is going on? Oh, Ethan, not so fast. I'd like to know what you've been up to. I'll explain later. I've got to catch up with Gwen. Well, tell me where I can find Teresa. She's in my bedroom. 